also apart from music industry. Yeah. Vitu gani zingine zenye ungependa kuendelea ama mmeingilia zenye mnafanya? Yes. Mm. We've, we've done quite a bit in the events. Yeah. Uh, back in 2016 we registered a company for Italian Entertainment where we it wasn't just an event company where people just come kuruka ruka mm. na kwenda. We were giving platforms for young and up and coming artists like us a platform to perform, build a crowd, you yeah. know, interact, produce stage presence, play in a car. Yes. And also we are, uh, we are lucky enough to be partners in our big brother's company called Sound Sematics. Mm -hmm. It's a record label just like what Frances is doing. Yeah. But for him also he looks for these up and coming artists from less privileged communities, yes. people who are purely talented, how he can be a microphone, mm -hmm. maybe release their first two or three projects just to give them a stepping stone to them. Yeah. So for us it's been events and yes. also trying to, you know, go the sustainable development way. Mm. Yeah. <laughs> to say be yes. to, yeah. Which is good. Yeah. It's really good. Yeah. Yes, and you, Mr. Ranjit? Uh, apart from being a music producer, yeah. I'm a TV producer as well. Mm. Um, I have produced a couple of TV shows. Yeah. I uh, used to work at Ebru, Ebru mm. TV, before I left, and then I decided now to pursue the music route now, like, seriously. I used yes. to work at, at at Radio Africa first, Corona hit, during the Corona period I went to Ebru, yeah. where I got to, like, produce uh, various TV shows. Apart from that, I'm also I'm a video editor. Yes. I'm a graphic designer. The dancer. Two left feet. Oh yeah. Uh, I'm I'm just I'm I'm a I'm a creative mm. in, 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 in all rounds. Mm. Yeah. Ah, nice. Yeah. And you? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. The same talk I'm telling you, I'm saying, I'm not on top of it. Me, but I'm eight to five. I'm an analyst by the by profession. Yes. Not creative. Yeah. But mm. also we would love to, to mingle with other creatives, you know, because yeah. certain was a need. We meet with painters, we meet with uh, people who deal with crafts. Yeah. Uh, we have someone up on Tani and it was LF. Yes. Mm. He, he does these bracelets, you know, mm. leather belts and all this stuff. Mm. And he's supplying like to this whole space, the LF, the guy yes, 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 yes. Amazing stuff. Mm -hmm. And also, I uh, would also like to get into them creative now entrepreneurship space where like the company that we're building in the tech space, yes. Art Africa and also society and trying to maximize on the potentials of the internet yeah. Yeah. and accelerate also the industry through digitalization. Mm -hmm. Anything and everything creative to yeah. go yeah. 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 That's really nice. Yeah. So, um, Right now, Bali Tuna Ilekea, there's so many things that are happening. Yeah. What wanna undergo depression? Mm -hmm. What wanna undergo societal thoughts, you know, people yeah. want to commit suicide. Mm -hmm. How does music play in this, you know? Mm. How does it play? I think uh, there are many impacts uh, that come from music. Apart from the employment, you know, it speaks representation of nations, it creates new ideas, but also it's it's very healing. Music is, music is very, very healing. Uh, you, you always find yourself maybe in a place where you are sad or nanny. The first thing that you want is to grab your earphones, yeah. headphones, and really bounce to. And you know, uh, there are different types of music that people make. They are healing music. As a producer, uh, Ranges knows uh, binaural music, you yeah. know, there's big music that um, keeps you calm, balanced, you know, mm. uh, connects you with your spirit, this is what they say these days, you know. Yeah. So uh, it's really therapeutic music in itself. Mm. So if you ever find yourself in that dark place or name, know that music is the medicine. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. That's what I will say. Yeah. yeah. Mm -hmm. I think okay. apart, apart from being it being therapeutic, it's there are artists out here who are who have taken music and used it as a tool to communicate yeah. about these issues yeah. of mental health and yes. there are a couple of songs you could listen to that that artist was in that situation and they got to pick themselves up and 
turn their life around. Mm -hmm. Putting yourself in that situation with that artist when you're listening to that song could yes. give you perspective mm -hmm. of how you could turn your life around to or not consider doing undergoing with 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 uh, mm -hmm. going through with the thoughts that yes. you have mm -hmm. of suicide suicide or uh, inflicting pain on yourself. Yes. So apart from therapy, kunangoma unasikiza and utasikia some information that could really help you. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So it's also a tool that educates and and gives information that in yeah. Yeah. Mm. Mm -hmm. And you and yeah. what do you think? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Like the music industry is something yes. but they just pursue it by the mm -hmm. you are like at the end of the day you know, depend on the kind of dynamic of depression someone mm -hmm. mm -hmm. on the the therapeutic remedy. Mm -hmm. Then be it by the uh, mm -hmm. it, uh, it has worked for me by the personally. Yes. I listen to music full time because my other works they are very very like they go very mind they a lot of thinking. A lot good drain, eh? In a good drain, sir. Yeah. So if you come and join it, it will take a drill. Yeah, for me. Yeah, yeah. I think that the good skin dog will be the branch is fresh. But uh, apart from that, that is come if it can be a remedy right now with the current situation. Mm. Just pursue it by the way. I joke some music or joke or joke. Since it's not that you can't be a Mm. a lot of things in yeah. music, a lot of things by the way. Yeah. And then for every client to bring, you want to master ranches and have to pay by the way. Yeah. And I take on paycheck. Yeah. Cut a check. Yeah. Cut a check. Yeah. Yeah. Mm. yeah. Oh, nice. Mm -hmm. That's really nice. So um, in the next five years, mm -hmm. what do you guys Brother, where do you guys see yourself? Mr. Tyler? Yeah. Mm. <laughs> ay, ay, ay. That's why I'm sorry. <laughs> Very good question. In the next five years, artistically, I think uh, more music, mm -hmm. more good music, more collaborations, yeah. mm, more impactful projects. Um, the company that you are building, I think the next five years when we sit down, we will be able to do it in music. Mm. And um, networking. Networking. She has years experience in the industry, but uh, I don't want to come through yeah. Sasa Nubaya. I'd really like to work with Vijana Baru Baru. Oh. Now, well, well, mm -hmm. They are friends, but uh, at Vijayangia mm -hmm. Studio, we will have a project. Hey, I'm looking forward to that. Yes, <laughs> and maybe, I don't know, internationally, mm -hmm. I'd like to work with uh, Otile Brown, because I personally see Otile as international. Mm -hmm. Yes, yes. yes. Otile yeah. Brown, definitely. Yeah. yeah. Mm. Is what yeah. <laughs> <laughs> And uh, Mr. Ranches. I think mm. for me in the next five years I would want God willing. Yeah. I'd want to have an artist or two under my wing. Mm. Mm. And not only an artist but also mentoring other upcoming producers. Yeah. Who have passion yes. for music. Because passion is everything. If you have the passion that it could drive. Yeah. Mm. That's what I'd look for in a, someone who wants to pursue art. Mm. If you have the passion, you, you're doing the right thing. If yeah. you have the passion for what you're doing, you're heading in the right direction. So maybe an artist or two. Or I don't want to sound <laughs> but maybe an artist or two, yeah. or maybe an artist and a producer. Just nurturing somebody to know Napier, 
it's possible yeah to do it yes um, and also wanting to leave something behind mm. and uh, that that it will have my name attached to unaona level yenye donjazi yako i think nikiweja donjazi want to be a donjazi mm. yes. yes like having having a a a a, a full working label that has real talent yeah. like what wana fanya people who are recognized nje yes i think that's that's where i don't want to be in the long run but in five years i think an artist or two mm-hmm. and uh, me and yeah just nurturing talent mm-hmm. uh, yes when do you see the industry the next like five years a, uh you the company that brown asema five years projection yet to used to empower 200,000 creatives to mm. cool to meeting in a working implementable channel yeah that an artist wherever mahali ambako yuko na whatever passion anafanya mm-hmm. anaweza ka monetize on it by the way yeah. ah kama that is tunaweza tuka hit that kind of target god willing ni retire ta kabla ni fikia 35 by the way mm. impressive yeah mm. Mwanafu Mombasa Yes, as well in the space of digital world right now. Uh, where do you see our music heading to? Digital world. I think on several platforms, mm-hmm. uh, locally, internationally, and also because there are many creative entrepreneurs coming through yeah. from Kenya mm-hmm. and people have um, platforms where you can sell your music you yes. have e-ticketing platforms mm-hmm. and all this so maybe being present in all these distribution and uh, uh, channels that can really put us on a different platform where mm. we are as artists you know recognized and we you know celebrated globally yeah. and also tap into that um, digitally digital space where now our works can also empower our communities mm. and also the economy yes yeah, yeah. Mm. okay yeah i think digital space by then on um um up and above the existing platforms ambazo tuko nazo mm mm-hmm like Kenya to Kenya to by there which i know it's possible because we are actually doing it by there yeah. Yeah. so if there are other people who are thinking like us uh maybe grow like compound it let's say like kukona uh maybe 500 channels that see necessarily peke yake ni kuna subscribers youtube but kutakuwa na mwananchi hapa kuna subscribers yeah. wako wewe mahali ambapo uko wewe ni celeb kip yako yeah. Yeah. unatengeneza ganji yako kip yako yeah. na the same same ndo msani labda ambayo yuko western anatengeneza hii sukuti mm. ama na channel like oh, itengeneza yes. zile stuff zake yeah. anajua ako na this market anaweza mm. kama manage within this channel mm. by the way yeah. so i think the power ya kuweza monetize kwa hizo streams ikianza kukuja into our hands more and more because yes. the further it is from us the harder it is for us to monetize mm. but, yeah. but the more it come closer and closer mm. then it is very very simple yeah. for creatives to monetize yeah. mm. you mentioned is a kuti you mentioned is a kuti ni kafikiri about do you know i think kama kuna watu wanataka za pesa wasanii yeah una bana kilo artist yeah, yeah. yeah. Those guys have another support system. Mm. Fan base yao inakonga crazy. Yeah. Yeah. Those guys will go anywhere. Mm. Mm. Wata, mm. Hey, mm. Wata, panga show place hata wajulikani mm. but kutaja. Mm. Yeah. yeah. People follow them. Yeah. Like yeah. I think what kama wakaweza if they can be brought into the digital world when you know and then they adapt it. Yeah. Mm. It could be a game changer for them. Yeah. Because mm. These people they just rely sana sana probably na gazeti advert mm-hmm. or radio kwa hiyo kidogo maybe mm-hmm. yeah. Facebook Facebook posters <laughs> 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 posters <laughs> steam yeah. oh my yes <laughs> but now if they are brought into the digital world vizuri venye venye hawa sani wa the new school artist venye wame deposition watu kama kina sauti soul yeah. in that way yeah. i think that would be a game changer for those guys mm-hmm. yeah, yeah. and also we can export our music exactly. mm-hmm. we can really export it mm-hmm. because you see the the foreigners 
usually come here yes hawataki kusikia sisi tukimba kama wao mm. wanapenda oh, sana yeah. wagoti yes. so kuti dancers mm. kwa airport yeah. and all this mm. stuff so with that digital connection to mm. now the international space mm. ipigwe sasa huko yes. kwa waangalie youtube yao yeah. huko mm. kinadaniwa kitisha kwa hiyo yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. yeah. nice. i feel like that's what nigerians are doing because yes. ukiangalia yes. music yao yeah ata ive the ascent mm. so if any wameeka in a way ni home ni home yes. and yes. that's why no one wanna okay no one everyone wants to work with them True. because those they guys, love those mm. guys sing things you don't know but we sing Ima, we dance bro the video na kuja hapa assemble line nzima we don't understand what he say and you sing back and that all you need to say ma say in front but kama mashaf here isukuti na genge to genge and we are new sounds but we have to use our local yes. sounds in everything it's true and then now yeah. sell it out there yeah. so support yeah. is the digital thinking here kwa kwa hizo hata kama ni youtubes and nini nini but we first embrace our own sounds mm-hmm. build something from it then we sell it out there mm-hmm. but bro mm-hmm. don't is go in a very different space yeah. Yeah. very different mm. so i know music industry is a very competitive yeah. you know yeah. industry yeah. so how how would you advise an upcoming mm-hmm. artist mm-hmm. I think I'll, 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 I'll say if you want to stand out in the industry yeah. you need to be unique mm-hmm. find a way to stand out and by standing out guys manage you have to kick it out yeah kick it and also you have to say kick it there are ways you can sell yourself just being unique without also no joy kick ndo inakuja kuuma wasanii after haribu image yako mm-hmm. then you start wondering why people put you in a certain box yes. where uwezi jitoa mm-hmm. because ndio mwa kwenda route yenye mm-hmm. you I love that things are drug yeah mm-hmm. the moment you do something mm-hmm. and then people unajua kuna watu watakuchocha yeah the people who are like oh jamaa kwa saa acha ndio yeah. yeah. the same same people are the same same What? people watakuja wata, watakutema tu mm-hmm. yeah so the way you introduce yourself to yeah. the industry image first impression ya kwanga very important sure. stafta kiki ukiingia watu watakujua ah ule msanii wa kiki mm. you know they won't even know you by the songs mm. probably you have a very good song yeah. yeah and you're very talented but the way uliingia that's how people are going to remember you you can be a creative person by just you know after a new way of probably performing you yes. can uh, set up something in your house you can like unazaita mabeshte kama watatu perform to them like the way i'm seeing DJs now nowadays when you are about they go to youtube mm-hmm. they set up in their house on itama bistro kaza they have drinks they having fun and a record mix yote yeah. mm-hmm. inside the house with like a mini party in the house. you know mm-hmm. just being creative mm-hmm. to sell yourself it doesn't mean that sasa unafaa uende na huko katusi za kielmotu za you get it so the competition is tight for sure mm-hmm. but um, I think when you come from a unique point of view usimbe kama nani yeah. usi dance kama nani mm. because moya david is dancing na dance ya madem kwa streets sasa mm. usimbe mimi anataka kufanya hivyo mm. yeah. choose your path choose yeah. your lane mm. ikikuwa mimi pia nani yake kivyake there is always an audience for that yes. so uniqueness most definitely for me yes. that's what i'll say to beat the competition just come out as unique as you can yes. mm. yeah mm. The cake is too big baby. Yeah, <laughs> uwe <laughs> zukapula yote. Yeah. So, yeah. so <laughs> kama si tu kula nice side, ungana na kula nice side. Yeah. <laughs> alafu the cake. Alafu the 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 um when you tunasa ma cake ni kubwa and also the ideas are there. You mm-hmm. just have to yeah. tap in and jua ni wapi unataka like mm-hmm. discover new things. Jaribu yeah. ku or you can borrow something here borrow mm-hmm. something here mm-hmm. and make something of your own so put in a gengeton so put in a gengeton you know you you, you another fuse such a thing and then it could a new sound yeah, yeah. and I will like this this, this is new mm-hmm. you can create a whole wave yeah and then unapata tu a new audience and that's it yeah. there yeah. is going to be history yes. now keep focus na hiyo mm-hmm. consistency pia Mm. That's what also sets people apart. Yeah. Consistency. Because mm. an artist will go to the studio today. I say I've seen very many artists who come to the studio. Yeah. Very talented. You make a song, you make a hit. Yes. It gets into your head. 
But what most artists don't understand, yeah. the moment you've made a hit, my friend, mm-hmm. you're supposed to be looking for another. Yeah. 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 Mm-hmm. Now, you're supposed to be looking for another. Now, you're supposed to be looking for another. But don't get comfortable. The moment you make something and people like it, we keep each other to say, "Eh, what do you think? Yeah, because what I've realized with Kenyans, Kenyans, they like something and then in a very short while, what a boy car if you don't like hit them with, with yeah. stay consistent, consistent with it. Yeah. So you just have to jipange to okitoa i. So, if your love life was a song, what song would it be? And why? I'm to tell you what I'm going to very tough and like a profile like with a specific song depth to it like there is a push to it there there is motivation to it and when you watch the video kuna the part where kuna hiyo mapenzi unaifeel kwa hapo ndani so that is the song that i would relate it to okay yeah me think right. I'll, i'll go with nyashinski mm-hmm. oh. <laughs> i think i'll go with that one oh, wow. yeah, cuz it has a lot of uh, a lot of praise mm-hmm. and because i believe uh, when you in love with someone it has to be someone that you you would want to praise yeah. at any given moment yeah. yeah so i think that song would, would really if would really go well with your question if if i know it by the couple of maliza the interview it's a crash on it and you as well maliza ah no no I'm just trying I'm just trying to think out loud by the unapenda blues I mean blues zangu hizo zile za TBT zile za kina Tyrese na mapenzi so boys to men hatari sana by the but kuna hii song inaitwa difference by genuine then I just like kuna maneno by ambayo anaangalia aje sisi si mazetu liona it's not a tango by the but genuine like has in a very very detailed as to why like akona that lady kwa hiyo song ukisikia the lyrics by the is kama unajua ngoma imba kuna ngoma jenye na zina asije ni na no my whole life has changed oh yes yes yeah yeah hiyo asha je jenye na kwa style ni mwenye uko na jiponsi ndani handsome to that we will skip it we are skip it but I'll choose I'll choose difference by genuine by the mm, yeah. Oh nice. So finally mm-hmm. social media and all this you know, ah, like to get right. to know you more. Mm-hmm. Hey, what who can draw the tackle draw? Where where can we find these good looking guys? Yeah. Oh tap at us go street. Like in social media Tylo Mill cross all platforms mm-hmm. facebook twitter uh, instagram tiktok threads kila mm-hmm. mahali mm-hmm. tailo mel tailo yeah okay i think for me ranges luta yeah. at inst- on instagram mm-hmm. uh, on twitter na nasikizi na itwa x mm mask alifanya ile kitu alifanya ile na mkasubui na fungua tafuta nizo yoko ya bad zone but yeah on twitter 
um, at prod by underscore and just Luther. Mm -hmm. Pale Facebook, I'm not so much uh, active, so I think. Uh, Instagram at Transis Luther, Twitter at Prod by underscore Transis Luther, on TikTok at Transis Luther. Mm. Yeah. YouTube. Mm. Yeah. Okay. YouTube. Hey, on YouTube uh, that I'll um. give you why. I'll give you a, re a reason. A reason to why. So I have one for parodies that I create fun clips that I put beats to. Yeah. That's in a time for Martin Ranges. Nikona Ranges Luther, where I put my beats like now the official beats. Yeah. I have another one for Afrobeat, and it was Luther Sounds. Mm -hmm. So when you search Luther Sounds, Ranges Luther or Martin Ranges, all those, it's going to logo moja, RL. All those are my channels. Mm -hmm. Get me that. Okay. Me, I'm going to need Tubna underscore Andy. Kila Kitu. Kila Kitu. Yeah. Ah, nice. Mm -hmm. Guys, I have had a lot of fun interacting with you guys it's been a pleasure thank you for having us <laughs> <laughs> just to sit down with you and get to talk matters concerning the industry yeah. and everything you know just get to come in your space yeah. you know it's we're grateful mm -hmm. and yeah we're looking forward to the growth of the industry yes thank so, you for having us thank thank you've been an amazing <laughs> host yes. oh, wow. movers, and <laughs> movers and shakers movers and shakers yes. <laughs> 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 <laughs>